After Budapest, Ferrari instigated a protest over an alleged increase in tread width on the Michelin tyres. As far as some were concerned, the issue of tyre measurement had been dealt with before. We asked precisely how, how and when are you going to measure it. Answer was new. Fine, we wrote accordingly. An oral answer or a written answer? Oral. There were two, there were four, four people present. Four from the FIA and two of us. And when was that answer given? It was in, uh, before Imola, 2001. But not everyone interpreted the rule in the same way. The construction and regulation, as far as we were concerned, was not when you, it would have said, furthermore, when new, the tread would be no more than 270. It doesn't say that. So we had an interpretation which was different, obviously, to the Michelin teams. We have a regulatory body. We have to. Why have did you wait for 38 races before um, raising this point? If you had this view all the time, it seemed an odd time to raise it, uh, Ross. That tyre, as I understand it, Patrick, you had at Monaco onwards. It's exactly the same mould, comes out of exactly the same mould that appeared at 2001 at Imola. Renault used different tyres to you, Patrick. There's a range of Michelins being used in Formula One. We weren't aware of the problem, so any suggestion that we had timed it uh, is inaccurate. Bridgestone are an extremely ethical company, and they were aware of this problem for some time and didn't raise it to our attention. Um, they were troubled with how to deal with it. And they came to us after the race in Hungary and said, how can we deal with this problem? Because in our view, do you have to keep laughing? Thank you. In our view, they brought the tire to us, the photographs of the tire in Hungary, and said, can you explain this to us? And we asked Charlie for an explanation. The FIA clarified the rule and stated that tires would be measured before and after the race, but the whole debate hampered Michelin's development for Monza. History shows this sort of thing happens, particularly when Ferrari find themselves in a competitive position and um, they take the approach that they fight the battle off the track and off on the track, so uh, it, it's not unexpected.